your point is an elephant. Hey everybody, you stuck at home and it sounds like a problem, you're not alone and we're about to solve them. You're bored at home, no need to smoke a dupe, just open up the tube and watch each travel do. And here we are at Tacos El Gordo. Tijuana style tacos. Open late for all you late night munchers. What are we doing right now? Hermosa is my homie Jared. Jared. Yes, please. Yes, please. What were you saying about Jared? Yeah. See, Jared, everywhere I go, I always tell him about you. Always tell everybody about the homie Jared. Yeah. I'm gonna pull up a picture right now and tell her she knows all me, Jerry. Wow. Gracias. Mm. A little behind the scene actions here. <laughs> My love decided that he wanted to get a little drink on since I kind of uh, drank everything last night. Um, so while I wait for him to come out of the liquor store, I have placed the food on his seat with the seat warmer on. We are not going to get cold food today. to go get ourselves some ta tacos well let us begin with saying that we actually had tried filming our first initial review but it didn't record i don't know the, the battery issues. died yeah technical issues yeah so you know for you guys we, we had to try it again i guess but oh no, oh no. we have to get tacos El gordo again guys like you guys didn't hear in the last video because we erased it. <laughs> These are freaking bomb. Fire! Um, so right here, we're going to start off with some asada fries. Mm -hmm. We got the campuchana fries, so it's half asada, half adobada. With this, we also got a taco de adobada. Mm. Two tacos de asada. And a quesadilla de asada. So they definitely have a different take than your traditional Mexican taco truck since they are Tijuana style. And for those of you that don't know, Tijuana style tacos come with guac. Guac. Handmade tortillas handmade too. Handmade tortillas as well. And they were nice enough to throw in some onions. We didn't even have to ask for it. They got us chilies, some limes, and some rabanos. And mm -hmm. <laughs> they gave us three forks because they thought more than two people were in the car. Yeah. <laughs> They didn't know we were hungry. Oh, no. <laughs> Nothing's going to stop us. No. Uh, you want to dig in first, man? Uh, you know what? Uh, if you're allowing me to, I'm super down. All right. So, guys, this has a lot of cheese, sour king, guac. Like I said, asada and adobada. These fries, I was carrying them on the, my lap, and my lap was kind of burning. Mm -hmm. And it was a 13-minute a, a drive mm -hmm. uh, from Taco Sal Gordo to the Strip. You're going to try that? And I'm gonna there's try two and make Tacos El Gordo in Las Vegas. And there's one off the strip and there's one on the strip. Kind of across Circus Circus. I've never been to that one, but I always see the line super huge. The good thing about this one is they actually do have a drive through Wow. I love these asada fries. It's just a fatty thing to get. And it, oh my gosh. How can you go wrong with potatoes, cheese, meat? And some sour cream. Recipe for delicious. Yeah. Let me tell you about my quesadilla. So what? Mmm. <laughs> precious food. <laughs> Djibouti does. Anyways. Um, 
So one thing that makes this quesadilla unique is that you have your handmade flour tortilla on the bottom and then you have a, a toasted corn tortilla on the top. And it definitely adds this like pow flavor. Kind of like what you get when you're eating nachos since you get that crunchiness from the top tortilla. And let me just tell you guys, their asala is on point. This is bomb. They, it hits the spot. This is the type of asala I want. And then just look at those big cuts of meat you have going on there. Wow, you made that sound so good. Mm. I'm going to have to ask you for a bite. Mm. I'm going to get that out of the box. Mm. Mm-hmm. You definitely did not undersell that. Mm-mm. You know what, babe? I think I'm going to have to dig into some of those tacos. Let's get in there. So we got these TJ style asada tacos right here. You know, the handmade tortilla, the fresh guacamole, and of course, the asada cooked on the charcoal mesquite grill. Mm -hmm. Wow, that was a big bite. The tacos for me are like two or three biters. But damn, this one was super good. Uh, not as flavorful as last time. Okay. Yeah. Let me take that. Still one. really good. Definitely worth trying. Mmm. So it's not as good as the first time, but it is still tasty. And also, we probably should add that we went like 30 minutes before closing. Right. Which is like 2 a.m. All right. Mmm. Oh, this is their alo bala taco. And the alo bala taco, alo bala taco does not come with guacamole. I just learned that. I didn't know that. But honestly, it's because you don't need it. The alo bala itself is so flavorful. And we usually like to go about mid middle of the day. That way it's had that time to just sit in that juice and marinade. And it's just delicious. All right, baby, I think we gave them a little taste of everything. We're going to have to come back to you because I am starving. All right, guys, it's time for that taco recap. So, will we recommend this? Yes and no. So, were the tacos good? Um, no. No. The only taco that was good was the carnitas taco. The chicken um, was good. The chicken was all right. It was passable. I, I, I would just get the carnitas taco. Um, like I said, Taco Tuesday, five dollars, two tacos, a shot. Um, very good deal. Yeah, I mean, I wouldn't recommend it so much because I think the flavor was phenomenal, but definitely if you're on a budget or you're coming to Vegas with your family. Or you're just uh, trying to get a shot for $5 and something I'm much on. Yeah, like this is honestly a pretty good deal. Uh, the carnitas taco was really good. I mean, I, I wouldn't know. I wouldn't know because someone did, <laughs> didn't save me a bite, but... The carnitas taco was good. Stay away. Yes, sorry. Stay away from that barbacoa. Don't even like give it a. Sh don't even give it a chance. Just no, no. No, no. Um, the chicken taco was pretty good. I mean, you know, not, not many people opt in for a chicken taco, but I think it was it was passable. And then the asada. I mean, who knows? Maybe it would be better earlier in the day. I don't think so. No. <laughs> it, it seems like they just relied heavily on salt. So. Yeah, that's true. There is no authentic flavor, which is what like we we really like from a taco stand or our favorite taco spot is that they have that that unique flavor that just doesn't rely on salt. But for five dollars, you can't really complain. Yeah, five dollars, you really you really can't complain. And we're here at the Ellis Island Hotel and Casino, which is just five minutes from the Strip, so it's it's a close cheat beat as well. All right. So after that disappointment, I feel like I needed something to wash my, wash the taste out of my mouth. 
I'm gonna be taking this double shot of tequila. Um, wish me luck. Tequila isn't my favorite. Shots are not my favorite. I, I always prefer a beer. But hey, it was that Taco Tuesday special. Two tacos and a shot of Jose Cuervo, five bucks. <sighs> Cheers. This is for Jared back home. Good luck. Wow, not as bad as I thought it was gonna be. I thought it was gonna be yakking in front of you guys, gagging. Yeah, you usually have a bad reaction to shots, babe. Oh, especially to shots. Maybe I'm just getting more used to tequila. So, Darla actually had a wild night yesterday. So she's opting out of her sec out of her two shots. So I'm gonna take them for her. <laughs> Let's try and get this back-to-back -back shots. Yeah, last night was crazy. <laughs> <laughs> So here's my hero taking my shots for me. Oh wow, I could really feel it in my stomach already. Yeah, tequila warms up your belly. Oh yeah. All right, so this one's gonna be harder. I have my Coke chaser. Let's try this out again. Wow guys, this is a, a sight to see. He never takes shots like this. Me and I line. I definitely got the taste of the tacos out of my mouth. <laughs> so yeah, I guess this is what's for. Um, two tacos after you after you have that bad taste in your mouth. So that's why they gave you the shots. All right. So let's check out some more taco spots. All right. <laughs> 